the case doesn't have to be a murder trial. It doesn't have to be some sex assault. When we talk about what type of cases I take on, I really look at, I go back to, we've talked about this many, many times. I'm looking at, is the person who wants to retain, are they getting screwed? Or do they have a, a position where I think they're getting run roughshod over by the command? Are they in a position where, you know, they're being taken advantage of or, you know, whatever that situation is. And if I can come in there and even if it's a small case, we were able to, I was able to take that case. I was already in Iwakuni. So the costs for the travel were significantly lower. I was already out there. And I felt we were on the moral high ground here. And people give defense counsel problem all the time saying we defend criminals and all of that. Well, this was a Marine gunny who was just getting screwed. And he needed someone to stand up to senior leadership and to officers. And, you know, whether that would have happened, you know, had I not been involved, I don't know. But the reality is I was involved. And we were able to stand up to the leadership and call them out for their lack of integrity and have an honest discussion about integrity. And he was we were able to save his career. So something as small as sending an an email, sending an email, something that would almost ruin this Marine's career. And so, no, do I typically take a case of, well, you sent an email and is that the case I'm typically going to take? No. But when this Marine called me up, he had a very compelling story about an otherwise solid career that was being derailed because of a toxic leadership. It was a toxic command climate. And I hear that all the time. And oftentimes I hear that there's a toxic command climate. It's usually a lot of it's the fault of the the service member not doing the right thing. So we vetted this client and talked with him. And I, I really got to understand that this was a good Marine who did have toxic leadership, who his leadership wasn't taking care of him and was doing the absolute wrong thing. And that's the case I can get behind, right? If you're under investigation or charged with a, an offense under the UCMJ anywhere in the world, in particular in Asia, and you need an attorney that can fly out to you, get on the ground and actually win your case, give me a call and we'll do a consultation. Get more information at www.belecchilawgroup.com or by contacting me directly.